Yo guys, really quick before the video starts, according to YouTube's analytics, 98% of you that watch my videos aren't subscribed, which is like, what are you doing, bro? Just hit the button. All right, guys, enjoy the video. Yo, what's going on, ladies and gents? My name is Arbuckle. Welcome back to another video. Today, we are once again back on Modern Warfare, and I wanted to share with you guys the best class setup for the new FAL Beef Eater Blueprint. Uh, this is a blueprint available in the new Season 3 Battle Pass. So if you guys haven't unlocked this yet, uh, you're probably well on your way to getting it. But uh, I'll give you guys a look at the stats that come with the original blueprint. You guys can see that we get a nice boost to accuracy and mobility. However, we end up losing a decent amount of range and control, and we can obviously to make this FAL a much better class setup and keep it uh, with the same essential stats uh, that we want to have in the green. So if you guys take a look at the stats for the class setup that I'm going to share with you in this video, you guys will see that we do just that by keeping the same boost to accuracy and mobility. However, instead of losing range and control, we actually get a pretty massive boost to both of them. Overall, this is a really good class setup that I think a lot of you are going to be able to do really well with. It's got much, much better aim down sight speed as well as sprint to fire speed. So overall, just a really good FAL class setup. So if you guys take a look at the attachments we're not going to be using a muzzle the barrel that we're using is the xrk marksman so with this we're getting damage range bullet velocity and recoil control obviously giving us a boost to the main three uh, stats here to accuracy range and control we lose a little bit of aim down sight speed here but we're going to make up for that with a few of the other attachments so again the xrk marksman barrel we're not going to be using a laser i don't think it's necessary uh, with a single shot assault rifle so we're keeping that off the optic that we're using, using is the Cronin LP945 Mini Reflex. Now, I know a lot of people tend to use different optics with different weapons. Uh, with the FAL specifically, because it is single shot, the Mini Reflex is even more appealing to me uh, just because I'm able to hit people from distance but also close range. Some of those big scopes that a lot of people like to use, for example, the Cronin C480 Pro Optic is really good from long range and it has a much better accuracy and range boost. However, when you come to those close quarters gunfights, even medium range gunfights, it's really not that useful. So, uh, Having that Cronin LP945 is really going to be great for both. And uh, I think you guys will like this one a lot better. So the Cronin LP945 Mini Reflex. The stock that we're using is the FSS Close Quarter Stock. So this is one of the attachments to really help improve our aim down sight speed since obviously we, lo we lost it with the first two attachments. Uh, this is going to give us another nice boost to mobility here. So again, the FSS Close Quarter Stock. The underbow that we're using is the tactical foregrip. So we're using the tactical foregrip to really give us that nice control boost. Since we didn't have that with the original blueprint, we still get a small boost to accuracy and range, which obviously we, we want, uh, but we get a massive boost to control, which is really important here. So the tactical foregrip underbarrel, we're not running any extra ammunition. Don't really think it's necessary with the FAL. And last but not least, the rear grip that we're using is stippled grip tape. This is once again going to improve our aim down sight speed as well as give us sprint to fire speed as a pro, which is very useful uh, with pretty much any gun in the game. Obviously, uh, any situation you're in, if you're able to start shooting first, it's going to make it a lot easier for you to win that gunfight. So uh, I'll give you guys one last look at all the stats and attachments that come with this specific class setup. If you guys have any questions or anything else to add, please make sure to leave it down in the comment section below and I'll be sure and try to help some of you guys out but i really hope you guys did enjoy this video please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and i'll see all you guys in the next video